Hello Cancer my darlings and welcome back to my channel Luma Moon Tarot. So Cancer I'm here doing I'm doing your daily reading but I'm checking into the energy that you're going to be in in the next five days okay. Um, just take what resonates my darlings leave the rest behind and thank you so much everyone for all of your support I truly do mean that. Thank you for the likes, the subscribes, the kindness, the love out here. Thank you, Cancer. I love you guys right back. All right, so Cancer, we're starting out with the diary deck, right? Um, what I'm seeing here, and these came out in clumps. Um, what I'm seeing is you leaving someplace, okay? Uh, this is making an escape. All right, this here um, is Joan of Arc warrior energy, okay? These are people that you're leaving behind that are maybe trying to attack you somehow or cause you some kind of pain, okay? And I feel like it's a whole group of people. This is a whole community of people doing nothing but attacking you. Um, or it could be a situation that um, you're going to be finding yourself in in the next five days, a situation or a place, and you're just not going to feel right about it, okay? You're going to be using your intuition here. Um, this is also intuitive abilities, um, and you're going to be leaving someplace, okay? You're not going to feel, you're going to feel like this is some kind of setup, I'm kind of getting the sense that you're going to feel set up here by a whole group, okay? And these are people that you're going to um, leave behind for good, I feel, after this. I don't know. I'm getting the sense that maybe you're going to get an invite out or this could even be going on a trip with some fake friends, something like that, okay? But you're going to feel very attacked or very mistreated. Um, you could be, they could be trying to use you, you know, for something, take advantage of you. It's a whole entire group. If you're going to be out and about, um, going anywhere in the next five days, or it doesn't have to be next week. It could be all the time cancer. Anytime you're someplace and it doesn't feel right, you should get out of there. And that's what you're doing. You're using your intuition or spirit's going to show you some red flags about some people. Um, and these are friends. These are people maybe that you didn't want to leave behind. You know, these are still people that are in your inner circle. Or um, maybe you're led to this place by somebody that you know and trust, but you're met by a whole group of people who wants to attack. And now, Cancer, here's the thing. I feel like you will defend yourself. You know, Joan of Arc, she was a warrior. She was a messenger, okay? Some of these people that you may be facing, they may be upset because of your um, intuitive abilities. These are people maybe that you could have even called out on their BS, you know? Um, this could also be exposure of whatever these people are doing behind the scenes, but I feel like somebody's going to try to set you up or you're going to be someplace where you just don't feel comfortable and um, you're not about to be attacked anymore by groups, okay? Uh, basically, Cancer, you're going to be like 10 steps ahead of something here. And you're going to be picking up on some really bad energy with your intuitive abilities. And it's going to make you leave. You're just going to leave this place. You're going to leave all of these people behind. You are not going to put up with any more attacks, no more putting people putting you in bad situations. You're not going to put up with it. This could just be a total cutoff of a whole entire group of people that you're going to realize in the next five days that they're setting you up, using you, or taking advantage of you, okay? What is this four of wands? for cancer yeah this could be somebody younger who's doing this to you cancer it could even be a problem possibly with your children you could even possibly be kicking someone out of your house a friend maybe somebody that you live with everything is about to be exposed look yeah look look at this cancer 
Spirit's going to show you everything. They're going to show you that you're being betrayed here. These are people that want to stick a sword in your back, but I feel like it's a whole entire group. I'm getting the sense that they are trying to lead you into a setup cancer. They just want to, this is theft. This is taking, um, taking advantage of someone as well. Um, this is a plan to sabotage you and it's all going to be exposed and these people are going to be exposing themselves and spirit is going to give you um, all kinds of signs synchronicities messages um, they're going to lead you out of a situation cancer there's going to be a group of people that are going to try to set you up for some kind of failure or it could be some kind of betrayal um, this is a plan that they're making for you for the next five days. I don't know. This is going to happen this week. And I feel like you're going to leave that you're going to leave this location or you're going to, you're going to leave all of these people behind. Cancer, I'm getting the sense that this is you. Injustice. Um, coming out with Joan of Arc, okay? And I feel like you are going to defend yourself. You may say something first, like I, I, I knew you guys were a bunch of backstabbers, you know, something like that. Um, I feel like a, ma a big major cutoff here. Yeah, I knew you people were toxic. The, the, something's going to happen that's going to ruin their plan. And Cancer, I, I feel like that is your intuition. They're trying to lead you into some kind of setup here. And I'm telling you, it's a whole entire group of people. It's, a, it's like a big group of people here that you're going to be around. And you're going you're gonna, to you're gonna stand up for yourself. You are. You're going to tell them maybe exactly what you think. Yeah, look, you've got your boundaries up. This is you standing your ground against the devil. Okay. Stand in your ground against the devil. This is totally a setup. And I feel like um, maybe when you do this, when you stand up for yourself and you speak your truth, there could be people in this group that are going to feel ashamed after this. Because they're going to be found out. You're going to, you know, they can do all kinds of planning and scheming to hurt you, bring you down, and betray you, Cancer. But when you stand up and you look them in the eye and you tell these people, I know, I've got you pegged. I know what you're doing. And I'm not going to allow you to do this to me anymore. I'm telling you, there's something that um, you, you kind of humble these people, okay? You sort of humble them, and you give the burdens right back to them, Cancer. You do. Then they're not going to know what to do. They're not going to know what to say. See, it's all fun and games until, you know, um, they get found out, right? <laughs> and I feel like there's something that you're going to say to them. It's going to be quick. It's going to be straight and to the point, Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting the sense, Cancer, that somebody's going to invite you someplace um, this week. But it's a plan to get you in one spot so that other people can, like, I don't know. They, wanna, they may want to turn you into a joke. They may want to um, make you feel humiliated, okay? This is a whole entire group that's doing this to you, though. But you, when you stand up for yourself, whatever you do, whatever you say, it's going to be honest, it's going to be quick, and there's going to be no arguing the point, okay? And I feel like in the end, these are the, these are the people that are ending up humiliated. This could be something that pops off in the public eye, and you don't care who hears it. You don't care who witnesses it. You are so done with being treated like crap, okay? You're done with people scheming and using you and taking advantage of you. See, they want to see you in the Nine of Swords energy, right? They want to see you um, stressed out, afraid, having anxiety, worried, right? They want to get up under your skin. And this is a whole group of people who are working together as a team to do this. But cancer, mm-mm, 
it's not going to happen. Okay, you, I'm telling you, you give these people a piece of your mind, you defend yourself here like a true warrior, okay, and you cut these people out of your world, man, without batting an eyelash, this is not going to happen to you. Okay, you are not going to tolerate people wanting to put you um, in, a, in a state of trauma or fear. You're not going to be made to be uh, fearful anymore. You're not going to be worried anymore. You're not going to be afraid to speak your truth anymore. You're handling this like a true warrior. And when you call these people out, especially for all to see, because you're not going to care, um, I'm telling you, they've got, it's going to humble them. It may, it may, they're going to feel like they're being brought to their knees and you do this with the whole entire group all at once, okay? Because <laughs> cancer, yeah, you're, they're messing with an earth angel here. You are very tapped into the divine. Spirit is going to show you all of these people are just, they're just getting together to treat you bad, cancer, get you all emotional and, and afraid, and betray you okay each one of these swords could be a separate people that are separate people i'm sorry a separate person in this group that wants to stick a sword in your back they're going to be working together as a team they've teamed up cancer to try to set you up okay but it's not going to happen like that. Yep, see, they want you to be all up in your head. They want you to feel stuck. They want you to feel too afraid to move or make any kind of decision. They just want to stress you out. This could be friends, okay, fake friends. It could be family members. It could be friends, family, coworkers, um, exes. A whole community and I, I feel like they're trying to get you to a different place okay because this is some place you don't want to be this is where you want to escape from okay and you do it fearlessly I don't know what they're trying to do they're trying to manipulate a cancer they're trying to get all up in your head okay and they, I feel like these people, it's a whole group of people. And they're like, we're going to do this. We're going to hurt cancer. We're going to um, betray cancer. Hooray. You know, that's not happening. That's not happening. You know, this could be six people, six to ten people that are doing this to you. And you're going to leave them all behind. They don't know what they're in for here, Cancer. They don't know truly who they're up against. Not only are they going up against you, but since you're so tapped into the divine, they're actually trying to fool the divine as well, and it's not happening with an earth angel. Okay. Yep, see, I feel like this is an event or a party or some place that they take you to. I feel like... Um, you know, this is this is given me attitude issues, right? Holding back, not wanting to share, but here they are flipping you off. These are people who actually can't stand you or they're hating on you for some reason, probably because of your abundance, your success. This could be friends that you still have around you that are fake, 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 cancer, fake. But when you speak your truth, there's nothing they can do. They kind of look at you like speechless. You know, you totally take control of the situation, my darlings, okay? Um, you do. And you bring their butts down and their stupid little plan. Clarify. Cancer, I'm also getting, this is something separate. I'm also getting um, that there's this King of Pentacles who can't stop thinking about you this, this week. Uh, you got a lot of things going on this week, okay? Um, they're seeing you as wish fulfillment. They want another chance with you. They're feeling like a complete and utter fool for missing out on an opportunity with you, and they're going to want to come and apologize. Okay, this is somebody that you haven't 
heard or seen from, uh, heard from or seen in like up to three years, maybe. They've been keeping their back turned, maybe waiting for an opportunity. Maybe this person is also at this event, this party, and they see you and you're absolutely stunningly beautiful. They want to actually apologize, Cancer. The rest of this group, I don't know who this is or what they're doing, but um, it's a skanky plan to hurt you, okay? But yeah, this King of Pentacles, you could be dealing with the Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, heavy Virgo energy. They may be very emotional when they see you. Um, I feel like this person is going to see you and just immediately want you and want to come up and talk to you and want to come up and um, apologize. Okay, yeah, they're going to be very emotional here. Um, they're going to be nervous because they know it's go time. This is their only opportunity, right? I feel like this person was praying for an opportunity uh, to make things right with you, and here it is, okay? Um, so, yeah, but here's the thing. I, I feel like you're sick of them too, Cancer. You know what? I feel like you speak your truth to everybody this week. You speak your truth to everyone this week. I, I feel like by the time this person wants to apologize, you're, all go you're gonna already be ticked off because you were set up by a bunch of fake people. And, and it's gonna make you not wanna talk to anybody after this. Um, you're not gonna trust anyone from your past. You may not know who to trust around you cancer because there's a lot of people around you that have put up um some kind of illusion you're not going to trust it you're going to be ready i feel like this week you're going to be ready to defend yourself and just waiting for that chance okay you may already know that this group of people is all that they're already fake like the divine may be already showing this to you and I feel like when you go to this event, you're going to instantly kind of feel like you shouldn't be there. Okay? Wherever you go this week, Cancer, if you feel like something's off or you shouldn't go or um, the divine is trying to send you messages to just stay where you are or stay home or something like that, I feel like you need to listen to your intuition. But yeah, by the end of the week, Cancer, you're not going to want to put up with anybody. You're going you're gonna to be standing there just ready to speak your truth because all of these people have betrayed you and you're just sick of it. Okay? You're sick of it. They don't know. These, none of these people know what they're up against this week. And I feel like they're all, yep, you're going to cut them out and uh, leave them all in your dust. You're going to, you're going to, I feel like you're going to speak your truth and none of these people will be allowed to come back in. Okay, some of them in the future may need your help, you know, but you're not going to allow them back in after this. You're not. So, yeah, Cancer, I feel like somebody's going to want to apologize to you, and there's another group of people who are going to try to betray you, okay? And at every turn in the next five days, it just feels like you are ready. <laughs> like, that's the feeling I'm getting here. You are ready. If these people want to hear the truth about themselves, fine then, Cancer. I guess you're going to be the one to deliver that truth and bring these people down. You're going to be humbling everybody this week, okay? And you're not going to hold back. All of these people are going to be in regret, all of them. But you are about to get that invite out. This is that fake invitation um, trying to lure you into a setup, right? So you can be betrayed and backstabbed. So get ready, Cancer, because you're going to get invited out somewhere by uh, friends or family, whoever. Just know, I feel like that's the plan. That's the plan. And Cancer, honestly, you are ready to bring these people down now. You are so sick of being messed with and attacked and betrayed. Oh my gosh. 
But Cancer, you are going to be that true warrior, that Joan of Arc warrior messenger energy this week. Okay, that's what this is. And Spirit's going to show you and lead you through this. And you are going to be that warrior and defend yourself quite easily. Where is the strength card? I had the strength card out here. Very easily. These people don't know what they're going up against this week. You're going to bring all their butts down, my darling. So get ready, okay? Anyway, Cancer, I am going to take this into the extended. Um, I, I already know you're going to bring these other people down, a whole entire group, but I want to see what happens with this masculine here because this masculine truly does want you back. And I feel like by the time they talk to you, there's going to be no chance because you're going to be in fighting mode, okay? <laughs> so um, I want to see what happens with that situation. If you guys are interested in the extended, there's a link to follow in the description box below that'll take you straight to Patreon, right? And until next time, my darlings, oh yeah, like and subscribe, right? Join this awesome soul tribe. And until next time, take care of you, Cancer, and peace out.